a sustainable treat from some whiz, whiz kids at Cal Poly Pomona. Students have created an ice cream using locally sourced ingredients. KCAL News reporter Jeff Nguyen shows us. Uh, this is the ice cream packaging that I created. Cal Poly student Rachel Hunter is part of the team that recently debuted the university's brand of ice cream that's proven to be quite the palate pleaser. Some of the elements that I included are the tractor in here on the Cal Poly Pomona Hills. The ice creams are made with ingredients like Satsuma oranges in this batch and avocados produced at Cal Poly. The university teamed up with Coney Island Creamery just a few miles away in San Dimas. So we are a Filipino owned company. We specialize in Filipino, Southeast Asian, tropical flavors and avocado ice cream is, is no stranger to us. It's Executive chef Tanya Tart says it's important to collaborate with a business that's both minority and female owned. It's important to bring some of that cultural diversity to campus. Um, but also to be able to help create those connections, those cross connections, you know, with food, um, with culture, and then just with the environment itself. The sustainability mission is key to the project. Both the Creamery and Cal Poly say avocados that are locally sourced are creamier and they have a smaller carbon footprint. We learn theory in the classroom and we put it in practicum out here in our farms, which actually halo our campus. So this product is something that they worked on and now they can enjoy. The ice cream has already won an award. Visual design major Rachel Hunter is happy. It's already made an impression. My favorite part of the design is my signature right here next to the Cal Poly Pomona Hill. The Cal Poly ice creams are for sale at the university's farm store with plans to scale up and add more seasonal flavors straight from the farm. At Cal Poly Pomona, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL News.